system admin user and if you just want to set your currency into IENA because you are working from India then this is the place set options so here we have you can set multiple things not just your currency first of all default pay so here basically you want to log in you'll get dynamics 365 sales and dashboard you want to set that into customer service and then something else cases because that is what you always check for example you check service cases so that will be your default pane always when you log in now it is sales and dashboard what is the number of record you want to display now it is 50 you want to display 100 per page it will take more time to load that's the only thing make it 25 what is the advanced find mode symbol or detailed let's make it detailed what is your time zone so the system admin will have set the time zone to this one usa sign or pst or pst you just want to set it to your time zone for example i will just set to my time zone what is the currency you have to use so here we have multiple currencies it's not added yet. so if you want to use gbp and your admin has added something else you can add it so you can just select the currency here use dollar and a few other options i can select what are the format i want to set for example the number the currency symbol the time the date format oh, i can just this is united states now now if you want to select indian it will be there let me see yeah it will be like different languages so you can see malayalam hindi marathi all that would be there so if you want to select format here now you can to know right hindi currency is in rupee symbol long date the date format also is given here so you can set it so this is not personal individual option not system option personal individual option. So then you just need to set up the email templates, email signature, etc. You can just set it here. So some of these are self-explanatory. So I'm not going there in depth. If you want to create a new email signature here, if you want to add a new language. Now in the system, we have only one language is configured. But if the system had been configured one more language, for example, Arabic, Hindi or whatever, then you will get that language here in this drop down. Select that language, click OK. So instead of account name, phone and everything, it will be changed it to the corresponding language. It will change it to the language of your selection. So we have seen pretty much everything. So that is the personal option. Just go through each of this, so we'll get a better idea. So we have covered all this and dashboards. Now we have a set of dashboards available in your CRM system. So if you log in, you have seen that. Now if, let me just refresh it. We have made some changes to the UI, right? So next time when I log in, my default pane would be service and cases. Let's see that. So we have to just refresh the page once. And if it is active, it will show you now it is still coming there. Okay, it's not saved. Otherwise, it will come to you as service and cases. 